Hello, everybody. Today is July 28th, 2020. What a great day to be alive, uh, as long as you're inside, whether it's air conditioning or fans. I do not recommend going outside. Real feel right now, uh, according to my uh, hand phone that I have right now, it says 113 degrees. Disaster. It was 100 degrees earlier, but it has ro- risen to 113 degrees now. So, hot outside. Do not go outside, but stay inside because you're in for a treat. Today is National Hamburger Day. It is National Milk Chocolate Day. And get ready for this, National Water Parks Day because did you know that more people go to a water park in the month of July than any other month? And more people attend a water park today on July 28th than any other day of the year. There are 365 days in the year. July 28th, more people attend going to water parks today than any other day. The uh, problem is, as I said before, we are in CVS, coronavirus season, and because we're in the coronavirus season, it's not safe to be in the water park, it's not safe to be around people, um, as my opinion, I'm not a doctor, um, that's just my belief. So, if you're watching this episode right now from a water park, good for you. Hope you're wearing three or four masks, which I'm pretty sure are hard to wear a cloth mask when you're going down a slide into water, but I don't know. Anywho, I can tell you today how to make your very own water park in your backyard. Get ready. All you need are household items, such as hoses, water, totes, water balloons, and a smile. That's how it works. Get a tote. Fill a tote with water. Outside, there's your pool. People can't afford pools. Pools are tens of thousands of dollars, millions of dollars for pools, right? You can get a tote, put water in it, right there, pool, free. One, two. Get a second tote, fill with water balloons. Then get a hose, hook it up to a sprinkler system. You can buy a sprinkler online at Amazon. I bought it for eight bucks, Amazon. So my backyard right now, I got a tote full of water for my pool, a tote full of water balloons. I got a sprinkler going back, forth, back, forth, back, forth, back, forth. Uh, And then I have a second hose in the front of my house, one of those really fancy hoses that go, you know, big, expand and big and stuff like that. Um, (coughs) Pardon me. And I loops to the back of my house. It's 100 feet long, the hose. So I have water constantly going there. So I created my very own water park in my backyard. You're all invited to come. Um, You know, free. Most water parks aren't very expensive. My water park free has sprinkler system, water balloons, <clears throat> water, splash pad, hose. And did you know, fun fact, water from the hose is by far the best tasting water worldwide. Better than Aquafina, better than Poland Springs, better than Nestle water. Water from the tap, uh, from the hose, best water ever. Happy water park day. Enjoy it. Also, happy milk chocolate day. I'm not a big fan of chocolate. I like vanilla better than chocolate cake. Vanilla ice cream, vanilla chocolate ice cream. But if you like milk chocolate, enjoy it, live it up, eat it. You do you. Let's get the party started. Today is hamburger day. I love hamburgers. Did you know that 71% of beef that is served in commercial hotels, meaning if you stay at a hotel and order food, 71% of beef or food order at hotels comes to be a hamburger or cheeseburger. Meaning we as Americans love hamburgers and cheeseburgers. Did you know that in the United States of America, in the span of one year, if you took every single hamburger we eat as Americans in a year and put them in a straight line, like that, that's called the hamburger line. That's hamburger line. Anywho, it'll wrap around the earth at the equator 32 times. 32 times around and around and around it'll go. 32. I'm only at four. I'm five. I can't count that high. But 32 times it goes around. That's how many hamburgers we eat. Wow. Because we eat more than 50 billion hamburgers in a year. Amazing. Also, did you know that in Seymour, Wisconsin, they have a hamburger hall of fame. So if you are on a road trip heading out west, if you're here in the States, in uh, you know Connecticut, if you're watching the show from California, heading east to Wisconsin or Canada, heading south, Mexico, heading north, wherever you are, you can make it. Go to Wisconsin, because in Wisconsin, there is a Hamburger Hall of Fame. Last fact, and this one is pretty amazing, and that is uh, the hamburger was actually created, invented, introduced here in, correct, Connecticut. (laughs) New Haven, Connecticut back in 1900. In 1904, it became popular worldwide at the St. Louis World's Fair. People came from all over to the St. Louis World's Fair in 1904 to eat this hamburger, but it was first put on a menu or served to eat in the state of Connecticut. 
That's amazing. We have very few things here that we should be proud of that we have created. One of them, hamburgers. There you go. Happy Hamburger Day. Happy Chocolate Day. Happy National Water Park Day. And may I say, if I were you, I will go ahead, get some chocolate, put it in the freezer, have a later for a snack, get a hamburger, have it in the grill. If you get too hot, because it's really hot outside. If you're too hot, not a problem. I'll get your sprinkler on. Sprinkler, hose, water balloons. Go to your own water park in your backyard. Stop, have a burger for dinner. Back to the water park. Come inside. Chocolate for the server. Enjoy July 28th and all July 28th has to offer. I will see you all tomorrow on Wednesday.